It's my lack of My lack of Hi YouTube, welcome back to my channel. I know I've been MIA for a while, but all for good reason. I am back because it is my one year lack of Actually, one year in about two weeks. I'm a little late, I know. I still follow my daily routine, misting with water, followed by maybe a little bit of oil and my Cantu Twist and Lock Moisturizing Gel. I still also shampoo with my Head and Shoulders Dry Scalp Care with almond oil at least once a week. I still do take my vitamins on a daily basis. And that's about it. Nothing has changed. Well, I did put together a list of, a, list, uh, a choice of slides from day one up until now. This is also um, a new growth challenge. August 9th, I stumbled on Curly New Growth's channel and she had just actually posted a video that day for the new growth challenge and if you watched it then you'll be part of that challenge as well um, I know the challenge runs until September I do not remember the exact date but I will post a link for that video and her channel as well as far as my retightenings I haven't retightened for about two to three weeks that works out pretty well. I usually don't retighten. I, I usually retighten sooner than eight, eight weeks. But I'm going to do this challenge. I'm going to do this challenge. I'm going to do this challenge. And I will try to post a video every week until the challenge is done. Um, as far as my hair right now. This is what my hair my locks are looking like now and they're pretty much locked I counted I've counted five locks that still have the braid pattern in it which is not bad they're going away and so this is pretty much the length um, if you guys don't know I did dye my locks of about a good I want to say six months ago and I want to lighten it up a little more, but I'm just gonna leave it alone. You can see the grays in there. I'm still gonna leave it alone. Um, far as length, hmm, that's after all the shrinkage and all that, so no more shrinking for me. Um, this is what it looks like in the back. I'm still regrowing the back which is quite a bit of a challenge and as well as part of regrowing the back and trying to keep it locked every time I wash it certain parts come out so I guess part of the new girl challenge I don't think I can put those back so I guess I have to wait till that's over and that's going to be a challenge because I got I have about maybe four, I don't want to say five, about four or five spots with loose hair. So that's definitely going to be a challenge for me. Um, I love my curl powder at the end. Love the curl pattern at the end. I don't stretch as much as I used to because I found out that when I was stretching my hair, it pulled all my butts. It separated my little butts if that's what you want to call it, my ends from my locks and I pretty much had to either rip, <laughs> which is not good, or cut them off. So I stopped stretching for a while. So, but if you want to keep continue stretching, that's you. I like to keep my locks and my little buds at the end. Even this kind of don't really bother me too much. But yes, this is what my locks look like now after a full year. Oh my gosh, it helped. I can't believe I made it from there to there and <laughs> from there to here. And that year went by extremely fast. I can't wait to see what it's going to be looking like in the second year. 
So I believe that is it. So enjoy the pictures from day one. I don't have no pictures of today. Guess this will be today. And um, I'll see you guys in about another week. I hope. Toodles.